YouTube, welcome back to round two of the AI video game tournament battle thing. Match two. Match two. And today, our contestants, the very popular and beloved, mm -hmm. I would say, Link from The Legend of Zelda versus from Devil May Cry, Dante. Ho, ho, ho. If you didn't see our round one fight, Mario versus Pikachu, Check the link in the description below. There's a bit of a story and a lore part, and we're going to continue that with a bit of a story and a lore part for this one. Let's get into it. As Mario celebrated his recent victory, the atmosphere backstage was thick with tension. Princess Peach, held captive yet defiant, watched Bowser with a mixture of hope and apprehension. Bowser paced back and forth, his massive frame casting a looming shadow. <laughs> Princess Peach, observing from her precarious position spoke with a tone of cautious optimism you haven't won yet bowser this tournament is filled with the strongest fighters from all corners of the gaming world bowser let out a deep rumbling laugh his confidence unshaken we'll see about that peach i've never backed down from a challenge and i don't intend to start now peach watched on silently hoping for a hero to emerge and put an end to bowser's ambitions Okay, so Link's strengths we have. He is courageous. Link is known for his bravery and courage. Because he possesses the Triforce of Courage, it grants him untold mystical abilities. Skill with weapons. Link is proficient with a wide range of weapons. Problem-solving skills. The Legend of Zelda games often involve puzzle-solving elements. The Master Sword, the legendary weapon that is often referred to as... The sword that seals the darkness. The ancient tablet, or the Sheikah Slate, primarily used as a tool with which to unleash the power of runes. Link has a vast amount of equipment that can protect against environmental elements such as hot and cold temperatures, allow him to swim faster, climb faster, paraglide through the air. You name it, he's got the gadgets. You know he does. All right, the weaknesses. Limited speech. What a weakness. Link is portrayed as a silent protagonist who doesn't speak. Very, that could be a weakness, you know. Dependence on items. Link often relies on specific items and tools to progress in the game. In some situations, he may struggle if he doesn't have access to necessary equipment. Weapon durability. In some Zelda games, weapons have durability and they can break after prolonged use. Limited stamina. Link must rest for a few seconds after depleting his stamina to allow it to recharge. Climate damage. In environments that are too hot, Link takes damage. In environments that are too cold, Link takes damage. <laughs> All right, so those are Link's strengths and weaknesses. Now, Dante, strengths, superhuman abilities. Dante possesses superhuman strength, speed, agility, and durability. Weapon mastery. Dante is a master of various weapons, including his iconic sword, Rebellion, dual pistols, ebony and ivory, and a variety of other demonic weapons. Devil Trigger. <laughs> Dante can transform into a more powerful demonic form known as Devil Trigger. In this state, he gains increased strength, speed, and regenerative abilities. Combat skills. Dante is a highly skilled and acrobatic fighter. He can perform complex combos, aerial maneuvers, and stylish attacks, earning him high style ranks in the Devil May Cry games. <laughs> What is this, the Gimme nice. Force? <laughs> I forgot all about them. Weaknesses. Overconfidence. Dante's cocky and laid-back attitude can sometimes lead to overconfidence. Impulsiveness. Dante can be impulsive and prone to acting on his emotions. This impulsiveness may lead him into dangerous situations without proper consideration. Emotional <laughs> baggage. <laughs> Dante carries <laughs> emotional baggage, baggage from his past, including like the loss of his family. His emotional burden can affect his decision making and focus during critical moments. Perfect. It's just funny. It's ironic because like Link can't speak, <laughs> yeah. so he can't even take advantage of like the emotional baggage. But it'd be funny if he like reminded Dante of his child and he like breaks down. <laughs> 
Devil Trigger Limitations. While Devil Trigger enhances Dante's abilities, he cannot maintain this form indefinitely. Interference from mundane concerns. <laughs> He's like, I'm hungry. <laughs> it's like, what is this? Dante is sometimes affected by more mundane concerns, such as financial <laughs> troubles or his own personal demons. Fuck, I didn't pay my visa bill. <laughs> Right in the middle there. of fighting yeah. <laughs> oh my god this is this dumb. is going to be a very interesting battle <laughs> we're gonna feed the ai our pre-made prompt that we did so that it knows exactly what to do so let's do it and we'll see what happens in a realm where fate intertwines the mushroom kingdom becomes the stage for an unexpected confrontation as Link, the valiant hero of Hyrule, and Dante, the devil-may-care demon hunter, find themselves teleported to this whimsical world, their paths cross in the most unusual of environments, the enchanted forest of the Mushroom Kingdom. Okay, okay, okay. Unlike the vibrant plains where Mario and Pikachu dueled, this forest is shrouded in mystery with towering ancient trees whose canopies blot out the sun, creating a twilight realm beneath. The air is thick with the scent of magic and moss. Ooh, I can smell it. And the ground is lizard. Sorry, the ground. <laughs> lizard. <laughs> the ground is lizards. <laughs> and the ground is littered with bizarre, luminescent fungi and twisted roots. Strange, ethereal sounds echo through the trees, and every so often, the quiet is pierced by the distant cries of unknown creatures. Nice. As Link wanders through this foreign land, his hyaline instincts on high alert. He clutches the Master Sword, weary of the unknown dangers lurking in the shadows. His Triforce of Courage pulses softly, a constant source of strength and protection. He's decked in his iconic green tunic, equipped with his bow, a quiver of arrows, and an assortment of runes ready at his disposal. Oh, cool. Meanwhile, Dante strides through the forest with his typical swagger, <laughs> rebellion <laughs> slung over his shoulder, and his trusty pistols, ebony and ivory at his hips. His devil trigger lies dormant, a hidden ace up his sleeve. Dante's heightened senses survey the strange land with a mix of curiosity and disdain. Their paths intersect in a clearing where the dim light filters through the dense canopy, casting eerie shadows. Link, mistaking Dante's bold approach as a threat, notches an arrow, ready to defend himself. Dante, ever the provocateur, smirks at the challenge and draws rebellion, intrigued by the unknown yet skilled warrior before him. <laughs> The Holy. clash is instantaneous. Link fires an arrow, which Dante deflects with a swing of rebellion. The hero of Hyrule then closes the distance, swinging the Master Sword with precision. Dante counters with a series of rapid strikes, his demonic power fueling his every move. The forest around them becomes a blur as they exchange blows. Link uses his magical bombs to create diversions, while Dante <laughs> responds with a barrage of bullets from bullets. Ebony, Ebony and Ivory. <laughs> The agility and combat prowess of both warriors are evenly matched, making the fight intense and oh, unpredictable. I'm nervous. Yeah, so am I. It's Me too. A, I'm getting a bit sweaty Me too. I'm, I'm rubbing my hands here <laughs> under the table. Dante, sensing an opportunity, activates his devil trigger, transforming into a more powerful demonic form. His attacks become fiercer, forcing Link to rely on his problem-solving skills. Link, in response, uses the ancient tablet to create a frozen platform in the air, gaining a momentary height advantage to launch a series of aerial attacks. Aerial attacks? The battle rages on, oh. with each combatant exploiting their strengths. Link's Master Sword shines brilliantly, its enchantment yes. repelling some of Dante's demonic energy. That's cool. Nice. Mm -hmm. Nice. Yep. However, Dante's superhuman abilities enable him to withstand the onslaught. No. His accelerated healing... <laughs> Keeping him in the fight. I don't like this. As the duel reaches its peak, Dante's devil trigger begins to wane, his energy depleting. Sensing this, Link unleashes a flurry of precise strikes, pushing Dante back. He then activates the stasis rune. Oh, cool. <laughs> the stasis rune? <laughs> yeah. Momentarily freezing Dante in time. <laughs> Just freezing him in time. Man, that is OP. <laughs> Taking advantage of the brief respite, Link channels all his strength into a final powerful blow. As time resumes, the Master Sword descends in an arc, striking Dante squarely. Wow. The impact sends Dante crashing to the ground, the Fuck. shock of the blow rendering him unconscious. <laughs> okay. That is so sick. That okay. is awesome. That is okay. awesome. Okay. As Dante lies defeated, 
Link stands victorious, though heavily panting from the exertion. I remember them talking about Mario panting too heavily. <laughs> yeah. They Sweaty. like the panting. It likes the panting. They like when humans pant. <laughs> the AI. They and like, how we eat. They like the idea of breathing. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the hero of Hyrule had triumphed, but there was no joy in his victory, only the silent acknowledgement of a worthy opponent's defeat. The enchanted forest, once echoing with the sounds of battle, falls silent, bearing witness to the end of this extraordinary duel. Link, with a respectful nod to his fallen adversary, sets off to uncover the mysteries of this strange land and the reason behind his unexpected journey. In this clash of legends, the courage and skill of Link had overcome the raw power and devil-may-care attitude of Dante. The Mushroom Kingdom had hosted yet another epic battle, adding another tale to its already rich tapestry of legends. <laughs> it's rich tapestry of legends. That like was that. epic. That was... I was getting chills. I was getting chills on that. That was cool. That was, that was really very good. cool. That was sick. All right, there you have it, folks. We have Link as the victor for round two. Whew. Whew. I was yeah, getting scared there that for was, a second. That was epic. That was pretty good. That was pretty good. But we're <laughs> going to be discussing the battles on our podcast next episode, so check that out. Also, leave a comment below what you think of this fight. Let us know. If you're curious to see what happens, stay tuned, subscribe, hit the notification button for the next match, which will be out soon.